first time ever, we are all getting a look inside Wayne Newton's 52-acre compound. The entertainer has been a Vegas staple for decades, and his home has been talked about for just about that entire time. It's opening up to the public tomorrow, but today, Action News reporter Yasmin Hassan is giving us an inside peek. Casa de Shenandoah has been a mystery to people across the valley for decades now, but today we are heading inside the gates. When you think about it, there's no place like Vegas, right? There's also no place like this place. Wayne Newton purchased the first five acres for Casa de Shenandoah back in 1966. Since then, the property has grown a bit. 52 acres with 65 Arabian horses and penguins and... Uh, uh, birds and uh, all different kind of animals that uh, roam this place and, and share it with us. Outside of his animals, Newton says this cup is one of his favorite possessions. He has spent years working with the USO and it was given to him by a prisoner of war. A thank you for all the support he has shown the troops. I'm excited to see what people have to say to see if what they have imagined uh, this matches up to or surpasses. Newton faced some legal battles opening the museum, but all of that has been resolved and he could not be more excited to welcome everyone into his home. This has always been home. It's never been any place else. We can't leave without showing you this. We are actually inside the private jet that Wayne Newton used to fly all over the world for his tour and now it's attached to the museum so you can actually come inside here and tour the entire area it all opens to the public tomorrow reporting from casa de shenandoah yasmin hassan channel 13 action news